It's summertime in Medical Lake. I'm going to be a sophomore. I just played one season of tennis. I think I started when I was like three. Brothers Brad and Curtis Kennedy are up early for Good Morning Northwest, promoting an event they truly love. Kids and just people of all ages just like learning to play tennis. But talking teenagers into getting up at 4 a.m. on summer vacation. Oh, nice. That's a job for this man. You can't have fun playing tennis and you shouldn't be playing it. Leroy Lee Masters is the kind of coach parents hope for when getting their kids into sports. Well, yeah, he's just, he's, Leroy's really sweet. He's been shaping young athletes on the West Plains for decades. I feel like I've advanced quite a bit since I started, but I still have a long way to go. And almost 20 years ago, Lee Master and other Medical Lake community yeah, members came up with a plan, a 24-hour tennis-a-thon. It was just started by somebody suggesting how to raise money for our food bank here in Medical Lake. And uh, all of a sudden we decided, okay, this is a good way to do it. Round the clock tennis lessons, mostly for kids, but also adults. And in those 20 years, the unique event has grown, benefiting the local food bank, outreach program, and the tennis team in a big way. Last year we figured up that we've probably brought in about $85,000 since we started. And a big part of the 24-hour tennis-a-thon, the ball bouncing competition. My friend Curtis here has won it three times, world record, an hour and 25 minutes. But of course, there's a lot more than tennis happening here in Medical Lake tomorrow. Face painting, music, food, and games, all right here at the high school tennis courts. And just like the kids he coaches, I'll bet if you hung around Leroy long enough, you'd probably learn more than just good form. I started playing in 1950, and... Here we are in 2016, so that's what can happen if you stick with it. As for me, uh-oh, I'll hang up my racket after today. Casey's really improved in the last half hour. <laughs> in Medical Lake, Casey Lund, KXLY 4 News.